What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Aaliyah Alicia, and I'm back with another video. In this video, I just wanted to quickly discuss my plans being homeless. It's very embarrassing to be homeless, but I live in a very toxic family situation where if I showed you guys the videos, you guys would tell me to run, get the fuck far away, and never come back again. I'm coming on here drained. I'm coming on here my authentic self. I feel very depressed. I feel like offing myself. I don't feel too good. But I'm still going to make this video anyways because honestly, at the end of the fucking day, I matter to somebody. I just don't know who. And this video is going to help somebody. So while I take this jewelry off that my mother got me, because I don't want nothing that she gave me anymore, I want to get rid of it all and everything, disrespectfully, and my parents, I hate my parents now, I just want to speak about my plan now that I'm homeless. Now that I'm homeless, I plan to go into a psychiatric hospital. That's one of the only options that I have because I have them, they have me as a history of my past going there to behavioral hospitals. I don't like it. I don't like being locked up in there without being able to have access to my phone. But it's something that has to be done in order to better my mental health because my mental health is absolutely at a drain. My mental health is drained. My mental health is terrible. And I'm not going to be able to continue to live like this. So if you're ever homeless and you're down and out, I wanted to say that you should try going to the hospital if you have a history or a record with them. Because psychiatric hospitals will take you much faster than much other stuff would. So you guys wish me the best. My goal is to get my own apartment and be on my own. I don't know if I'll ever do it because apparently I'm just a bum to my family. I don't mean shit to anybody or anything. And I never will. can't get this jewelry off and I'm about to pop it. Come on, come out. Come out. There we go, it's off. I feel free. Just cutting my family that's toxic as ever, cutting them off, I feel free already. I feel very sad because I don't know what I'm going to do, but I feel comfortable knowing that I'll be in a safe place where I can eat peacefully, where I can poop peacefully, shower peacefully, and hopefully get back on the right track with my life. Staying sober, staying clean, all that stuff, staying healthy. So I hope this video helps somebody. My goal is to get you guys to know about psychiatric behavioral health hospitals and know that there are beds and know that there's opportunity in somewhere for you. If not, maybe a shelter will be your best bet. A lot of people get in shelters. A lot of people don't. I'm one of those who have not gotten into a shelter. So I don't know who's going to help me or what the plan is, but um, I just plan to deal with my social worker and I plan to be on my best behavior and hopefully get the help that I need. So that's the end of it. That's where I'll be at. That's why I'm quitting porn. How I'm quitting everything. I'm actually not going to be on anything for a while until I'm better and I'm back. Because I don't feel like myself, I don't feel good, and I'm not okay.